الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم وبارك على نبينا محمد وعلى اله وصحبه اجمعين السلام عليكم ورحمه الله وبركاته what is a zakat a zakat is an arabic word that encompasses the meanings of a numu as a product of allah's blessing and a tahara purification cleansing in islamic terminology a zakat is used to refer to alms or charitable offerings whether mandatory or voluntary that a person extracts or takes out from his wealth or from the wealth he has accumulated the obligatory zakat is considered allah's haq his entitlement his right which must be spent or distributed in the manner that pleases him subhana what is the connection between the linguistic and islamic meanings what is the connection between an numu wa tahara growth and increase and purification and alms or charity or taking wealth out of the wealth that we've accumulated or taking an amount out of the wealth we've accumulated number 1 when a person pays a required zakat or gives charity voluntarily while not being required to do so he has every right to hope that allah will bless his earnings and give him more his wealth will therefore yanmu grow or increase as a product of allah's blessing his soul will also tathur be purified or cleansed of the greed associated with hoarding wealth and refusing to share it and his soul thus purified will tanmu will grow and be blessed because good deeds are like a magnet for other good deeds and allah's blessing the more good we do the more we are guided to goodness and the more allah blesses us at this time of year brothers and sisters there are many questions about a zakat who is entitled to a zakat how do i calculate my zakat what types of wealth are zakatable etc inshallah over the next few days we will try to provide answers to these and other questions in a series which we've entitled zakat lessons so please stay tuned with us when and as you can and we'll be providing some important lessons and instructions and information and rules and regulations related to the islamic tenet of a zakat may allah subhanahu wa ta'ala be with you may allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless you last few days of ramadan most fruitful and blessed for you may he accept your prayers may he accept your fasting may he accept your night prayers may he accept your supplications your dhikr and all the good deeds that you're doing in these last 10 days and make us all from those who he will accept their good deeds and forgive them in this month for all their previous transgressions هذا وصلى الله وسلم وبارك على نبينا محمد وعلى اله وصحبه اجمعين والسلام عليكم ورحمه الله وبركاته